they visited Tobago and Guyana, returned to Trinidad, and then left for New York. Earl Springer then went to New York by boat and met with Abakavi, who took him to Washington to meet with the Ethiopian ambassador. Earl Springer then left by ship to London. Both his Ethiopian visa traveled to France and then to Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. Then nights before his departure from Trinidad to Addis Ababa, the executive of the non movement drafts a 10-point memorandum, which in general requested that the Ethiopian Orthodox Church be established in Trinidad and Tobago. This memorandum was presented to Abu Basilios and his Imperial Majesty Health Nazis of First. And the next day, meeting was arranged with Abu Basilios at the meeting as Springer was informed that it was not possible for anyone to be sent to Trinidad as Trinidad was a colony of Great Britain. Thereafter, he met with his Imperial Majesty, discussed where he and Ato Tatarawa, you can correct me, the, the private secretary of his Imperial Majesty, explained a relationship between the Ethiopian and the British government. He said that they could not send anyone to Trinidad officially, as this would cause unrest, uh, unrest between both governments that they decided that someone would be sent, unfortunately, as a stranger returned to Trinidad and with the uh, required funding from his Imperial Majesty, or Daniel, that a bishop be sent to Trinidad. On December 16, 1952, Abad Abraham Yusuf Meshesha was sent to Trinidad as the first Ethiopian missionary and established the first Ethiopian Orthodox Sorry. Church, Parish Church, by the name of Melania Lem and Aruka Trinidad. 